I'm back with another video today, and I am going to be attempting a front handspring, like in the title above. So as the majority of my peers know that I have been starting practicing to do a front handspring, and today my word has come true. Before I begin with the video, let's tie my hair. I might have not tied my hair so well, but now that that's out of the way, um, I'm going to be telling you about the front handspring that I will be doing. Now, you might be wondering that there might not be that many front handsprings. Actually, there are not at all, but there are different stages of front handsprings, which is the beginner stage and um, the more complex stage, which I'm going to be attempting the beginner stage front handspring. That's because I know how to do everything to do a front handspring, but, you know... So I'm not going to be doing it on any mat. I'm going to be doing it on a hard floor. So let's go. Now it might not be that well, but don't judge because like, you know. So yeah, let's begin. To start off this front handspring video, I will be doing a running front limber. So it's basically like a front walkover, just when you do a handstand position, with your feet together and then you land into a bridge and then get up. So that's the first thing to do for your front hand. Right? So let me stretch. And then. And then I'll do it with my feet. Hold on. All right, I think I'm ready. So yeah, let's begin. that was the front limber and now I could start doing a front handspring so the beginning front handspring is beginner front handspring is like a front handspring that is like you run and jump into a handstand and then like pull your feet back in a swift motion one after the other and you might not know what this looks like but it's a beginner front handspring and the more complex front handspring is when you um, in, are in handstand position after you jump into it. Um, you jump with one leg coming after the, on the, another, but the difference is that you don't have your hands on the floor. So I know this sounds so hard to know and it's like confusing, but don't worry, we're going to get that over with. So let's attempt the front handspring. Now that wasn't it, not at all. So let's try that again. Not really, but closer than the first time. That's for sure. Well, it didn't go that well that I planned. But remember, I didn't plan to be so good at the beginner front handspring, but remember, I'm still learning. So when the mat comes, I will be going to a bigger space outside, because here is kind of like a little bit too little of space. That's because my building owns a private, a private park where only the building residents could enter, so that's where I will be going and I will be less traumatized then because I'll have some support for my feet and I won't hurt myself. Not like I hurt myself right now, but just it will be better than on hard floor when I'm starting to learn. So yeah. So now I'll be trying it on actual hard floor because I just had a rug there. So I rolled it up so that it won't, it will be less bothersome and I will try again because it's fun.
Okay, that one wasn't at all a front handspring. Well, I wasn't doing front handspring. Okay, now you know what's bothersome? This couch. I don't think that was much better than the first one. Okay, that was better. That was really good. That felt awesome. And I know you can't really see me, but... Whoops. So I'll tell you what happened there. So, like... I am not banging on purposely, and I'm not banging that loud either. So, like, all for like, you barely heard that, and that's how my banging sounds on the floor below. And the, like, my neighbors are so, so annoying, and I'm not surprised. So whatever. But let's do that some more. So I guess that's it for today's video because, I mean, I'm not that well at front hand sprays, but if I continue doing it, like my, nova, my neighbors will get so annoyed that they'll come to my door and like fight with us. It happened before, but like I, we, I know how my banging sounds and it's not loud at all. So it's just, they're really, 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 really judgmental. So yeah, they are kind of judgmental. See ya. See ya.